Sarswin Temash Institute for Indigenous Management has been around uh, from 1997. It was formed by the leaders of the buffer communities of the Sarswin Temash National Park. What we believe in is in true community empowerment. We train community members and they go out and they do the work for their community. That creates a sense of ownership. The sustainable logging, it's different than do illegal logging. There are certain sizes you could cut, not all trees. If we have a transit line from one to 1,000, maybe it's only eight or nine trees that will come out on that transit. In terms of the sustainability aspect, we created, along with the community, a sustainable forestry management group. And this is showing how community can operate, they can manage their resources and ensure that they can contribute to the country's economic development. They pay taxes, they create employment for their community members. Everybody participate. Every two weeks they have a rotation. There's jobs in other communities, not like before. Before, there's a lot of people go out and look for a job. But right now, Everything is here. They sleep home, they got a food home, everything is in the communities. We've trained women to go out and gather the data for the points, for their boundaries. And so what we have seen is we've had more women be active in those boundary demarcation efforts in negotiations with their neighbors. Before it was only men who do the GPS, but this was an opportunity for us women. This is the first time we had women's doing the GPS. We are helping our community with the mapping. We went to the boundaries, especially now that we are fighting for our land title in the community. The renewing of the forest inventory license for Rashmu Keche, we were part of that, the 43 sample plots and the permanent sample plot that we had just done. The Rashmu Keche have the administrative officer. We have provided the basic financial management in terms of recording, bookkeepings, and also entering for its data in Excel. When we're working with indigenous communities, we do need to know that it's a bit different. Um, and we just need to support because the potential is there, as we can see with the community of Coneo. It is there, as we can see with the Mayan brand Shale. Potential is there, opportunity is there, we just have to work through it and be supportive. Mm -hmm.